Hi right, guys, Real Football Manager here. Quick update in the bath, where else? Um, look, I'm going to be doing this save. Um, I'm going to be doing stuff about uh, kind of a weekly vid now. So I want quite a bit of progress to take place rather than just keep bombarding people with uh, willy-nilly mid-table clashes. Um, but that's the current progress so towards the end of the season. That's the system. Um, it's a system I'm staying with. Uh, I do love it. It creates chances. It's been solid because I know this team is generally uh, a National North team on the field. Um, <clears throat> And it's finished mid-table. It's high risk. It's got the defence. So we, we do concede on the break. Um, long balls and stuff like that. Um, pacey strikers. Bobby Carroll has been immense. And we we changed position. And we were in horrendous run of form. And, you know, I think we changed his position from about, it was about 20 odd, 28 games, 27 games. And he never scored. I think he'd scored one. And no real assist. Since I moved him inside forward, he's been a revelation. And as you can see, he's not. he's completely unfamiliar there. Um, and I have um, got him training there to see if he can become more familiar. Uh, and he says he doesn't like it, but he's still giving it a go, blah de blah um, But look, this is the save, guys. You know what it's about. Um, I've had to let players go. If a bid comes in, look at Bailey Ty Edmonton now. If we still had him, monster player. We've had to let go Kieran Loach, which I was devastated about again. is another cheap one, 50k. He's now worth 50, 550. And look how good that Coll Collett is, is becoming. Um, we have to sell if a bid comes in from a team in a higher division, which is really frustrating and it's really threatening any kind of potential growth, really. Uh, and the money is not that great. Uh, but here's the run of form I've been getting on. I mean, we had an absolutely disastrous run of form since I last seen you. And we went to Newcastle away in the cup, expected results, compared, you know, considering we were down to 10 men after 10 minutes, it was horrendous. But I noticed we, we actually won the battle for possession. Um, but we pulled it together and I think them greens and the draws sort of started when we, we, we brought Bobby Carroll into um into the kind of inside forward role and um you know we were playing too many games every three day every three days as well, which was a nightmare because we just haven't got the squad to do it. So um I was I was chopping and change and there's there's the budget. I can't spend any money, I can't buy any players other than ones who have been released by clubs. Um, that are based in the northwest, but look, I put the money to the transfer budget, so it looks like we had money to spend, and I, and we got the youth facilities as adequate, which which is great, which and we will continue. So if we do sell, we need to sell for big money. I put guys, I put my youngsters now on big contracts. Bobby C, Snowden, I just clicked on, um, Jackie Stewart in goal. Uh, I'll be pumping him on a good contract soon, sooner or later. And I'm Eric Freeman, who I'm really hopeful for. I've put him in midfield, actually. He's natural there as well, as well as centre-back. He's a prospect. So see if there's your 